I'm Rocky. And this is Zach. We do video. Real, simple video. Our company is 12 Stars Media, and when we met Greg of Cross Creative, we decided to share an office together at the Marketing Block in Greenfield, Indiana. This is our reality series. It's about the type of people who would make a reality series. This is Media for Hire. We were invited to join the members of uh, Hoosier Chapter of PRSA um, as they went up to Grissom Air Force Reserve Base. And the reason that we um, went up there with them was to document uh, their day and uh, make a video of it. Um, but of course, Rocky and I uh, had a little, a little bit of fun along the way. I ran to the gas station real quick. Get something up here, buddy. Hey, man. Got you something. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we are here at Grissom. Checking out these uh, jets and planes. Ooh, look at that one. Uh, call signs are definitely in order. And uh, I... Um, what do you mean? Call signs. You know, like, like not our real names, but like, but like what we're called, like in air. And so I'm definitely, I'm definitely Maverick. And you, what? you could be Goose. But Goose dies. Well, yes, that's true. But you're not going to die today. I promise. I promise you're not going to die. I'm not going to let anything happen to you. I promise. That's what he said in the movie, and he still died. That, that's true, too. But... This is what, completely what? different. You, you're Goose, and I'm Maverick. You look at it, it's just like it's just like how it's just like how I'm White Earp and you're Doc Holliday. Oh. We we fit certain character profiles, Zach, and I'm definitely Maverick. You're definitely Goose. <sighs> We're going to be flying on a KC-135 R Strata tanker. So the C-17 then, what is it doing today that it needs to be refueled in flight? If you um, I haven't talked to the C-17 crew, and I don't know if the, our crew has or not. We can probably ask that question. The chances are that if that C-17 needs refueling, he's probably going from one part of the country to another. Maybe to deliver an aircraft part. Maybe he's taking a team of, of Army paratroopers to go on a training exercise. I wanted to mention to everybody, it, I, when, when, when the Colonel and I first spoke about this opportunity, I, I said, you know, I wanted to find value in it for our membership, and so we have the crisis uh, communications kind of portion this morning. How many aerial loops will we actually be doing? <laughs> Two basically go into an orbital pattern, but the crew has that pretty much designed where we basically rendezvous at a specific time and location. Okay. okay. No points where we go upside down, though. No. Oh. <laughs> you, uh, you got what they were saying in there at the briefing, right? About looking, you know, looking for the best the best of the best, you know, social media top gun. You know what your problem is, Maverick? You're too dangerous. That's right, I'm dangerous. Iceman. What? Oh yeah, gosh, it's so bright out here. Major Island Feld, he's going to tell us a little bit about uh, the, the big old plane that we're on right now. This is the uh, KC-135 Strato tanker, and basically its uh, primary mission is to refuel other aircraft in midair. Wow. What, what are we going to go fuel today? Today we're refueling a, a C-17 cargo plane. Okay. Um, how long have you been doing this? How frequently do you do this? Well, as a reservist, I typically fly a couple times a month, but uh, I've been flying the tanker since uh, about 2004. Okay. And what, what's your favorite thing about, about this job? What's your favorite thing about doing this? Uh, I love flying. Flying's a lot of fun. I like the people that we work with. We've got some really wonderful people at Grissom, and um, yeah, just traveling around the world. Uh, get to see some pretty cool places. One more, one more question. Um, when, when do uh, when do I get to fly the plane? Do you, 
got 50 bucks on you? <laughs> Actually, sadly, no. <laughs> Unfortunately, I'm sorry. We, we, we draw the line at 50 bucks. I'm... Maybe, tickets or something. Maybe I can maybe I can still be social media top gun. I'm with, I'm with Tech Sergeant Byerly here, uh, and this is the guy, uh, I don't know if you can see him, you can see him a little bit in the in the video when we, when we were down in the, well, I'm, I'm going to ask you, what, what was that that we were down there doing? Uh, we you were, you we were, were really doing it. We were refueling a uh, C-17, it's basically a cargo aircraft, um, they haul passengers, uh, other aircraft, tanks, whatever it needs to get overseas or wherever it needs to go, um, in the country or out of country, doesn't matter. Um, Basically, we were just doing a little training today. We gave them a token offload of a thousand pounds. Um, they had uh, some training on their end that they needed to get done. Uh, they were able to get their stuff done. We were able to get ours home and uh, get back home here. So, talk to us about that mechanism and how. I mean, without the intricate details, but what what essentially is, is going on there? Uh, it is a flyable boom. Um, there's a rotator control stick down on my right hand side that I can control and fly the boom. Um, on the back, there's uh, two black wing surfaces, uh, they're called rotivators, uh, basically they're a flyable surface uh, of the aircraft, um, at which point I can fly that boom anywhere I need it to go. Uh, they come up, they're supposed to sta uh, stabilize in a certain position, at which point I go ahead and extend and there's a uh, rigid boom that comes out and make contact with the aircraft and we transfer fuel. Miles per hour, it's probably around uh, 406 miles an hour ground speed. Awesome! Rocket! I felt, I felt a need, a need for speed. Average? What's up, Goose? <laughs> so we're alive. We are, in fact, alive. Was there any concern? Well, well, I suppose there, there, there was. was I me. suppose there was for you. So, who was it that won the Top Gun Social Media Award? You know, um, Chad and I talked about it. We had we had a good good talk. Hey, Maverick. All competition aside, you can be my social media wingman anytime. Psh, Iceman, you can be my social media wingman anytime. Okay, so now that Iceman and I have made up, uh, we're not going to fight each other anymore on social media Top Gun, the next really thing to do is figure out who is social media Top Gun. And most of you know, or at least some of you know, that we had a contest on our Facebook page yesterday and the night before to determine who you think, our fans, is the social media Top Gun. And we're going to reveal that in just a minute. The first thing I want to do is say thanks to the PRSA folks. Uh, to Chuck Ghost, who initially turned us on to this whole event. Uh, it was a blast. We had a lot of fun. Thanks a lot for that. And then a big shout out to Mark up at Grissom Air Force Reserve Base. Um, great time. All around great people and great time. So now the only thing left to do, who is that social media Top Gun? We're going to reveal it to you now. Yeah. 